All right, you Chad gamers, welcome back to Super Mario RPG Masters. Uh, you can see in the back we got Kirby, and uh, over on this side we got Cerno, and uh, I also got Marissa with me. So uh, the whole gang is here, <laughs> and um, hopefully I didn't accidentally break this game's difficulty in half by getting the ice blast early. I guess we'll find out, though, right? I mean, we're gonna have a little fun with this game right now, right? Found the frog coin. That's a flower. Yeah, let's look fight these guys to see what's up. Oh, great, my favorite enemy is back. Oh, boy. Yeah, let's try it out. Oh, yeah, that is pretty- that is pretty damn good. Ah, oh, you're gonna be an asshole, huh? I can do it again. Are you just gonna spam that every time I use an ice move on you? This isn't going as well as I thought it would. <laughs> I will make you waste all your FP. There we go. <laughs> you can't you can't run away forever. Oh, and you have static E as well. Okay. Oh my god. He actually got his turn off. Okay, so this is clearly clearly not going to work. The second I get Ice Blast, an enemy's uh, spam restore. Oh, never mind. Am I supposed to use Fireball on him then? Maybe if maybe it'll burn him like completely. Oh yeah, that is way better. Backfire. <laughs> Why do you have that? Why do you have that move? That's like, that's the, supposed to be the Stumpets move, not yours. Oh, okay, now he's spamming backfire. Interesting. Actually, let me just see how much Ice Beam does on its own. It's probably gonna do more than the Ice Blast. And did decent damage. Honestly, I might go back and get, uh, I might go back and sleep at the inn again, to be honest. That kinda, that kinda sucked, honestly. That, that was a nasty loadout. You can't just put two artichokers and a blue amanita in the same loadout, I expect me to be okay with that. I, I didn't remember, I didn't remember that dialogue being in the game. Toad going to Tadpole Pond? That's a new one. Alright, so uh, the enemies here are kind of assholes, honestly. Can I fight the Lakitu, though? Let's see what the Lakitu's got. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> well, yeah, we also, have, we also have Data Drain now, so that's a pretty useful move. It costs a lot, though. Yeah, restore, restore someone besides yourself. That way you'll die faster. No, don't restore yourself. Wait, I have, actually, I got a question. Why was if I jump on him? Oh, he takes 255. I think that's the max amount of damage I can do with the jump. Because doesn't the jump cap out at a certain amount? Pretty sure it does. Yeah, Mel does barely any damage. Surely Jump will do a bunch though. 128. Alright. Hmm. 
And I already need to heal, so let's do just that. We learn a new technique at level 23. Wow. And level 15. Let me guess. If I if I had to take a wild guess, a star. Okay, they were, yeah, they did get rid of the rock candy. If I had to guess, the um. Geno be Geno boost is like NFP now or something. Oh wow! Look at how re look at how reasonable this loadout is. Let me let me shoot him with fire. <laughs> yeah, that does a lot of damage. Still don't know why they decided to give him backfire. It's a very weird, weird move to give him. But all right. <laughs> oh, he's dead. He's dead already. <laughs> Well, yeah, when there's only one artichoker, of course it's gonna be piss easy. You know, if it were me, I probably would have put in, like, a super artichoker there. <laughs> yeah, he, um... He used backfire on me. Oh, yeah, let's get our free flower over here. Oh, yeah, shoutouts to the, um... The enemy bestiary guy that's chilling here in the remake. I don't know why he's uh, he's there. Cause I don't think there's an NPC here in the original. Anyways, that was a uh, booster pass. It's not really much of an area, honestly. It's just kind of here. <laughs> Bowser. That man's King Koopa. Yes, you're an NPC. Oh yeah, and right, in this game doing what every Mario RPG ROM hack does, replace uh, Toadstool's name with Peach. I mean, there's actually a really good reason for that, though. The reason, the reason why everybody does that is because this game has a, like, text limit. And, um, by replacing Toadstool with Peach, you save, like, three characters per instance. <laughs> so, it frees up a lot of space for potential dialogue later on. Which is really nice. Anyways, we got Bowser. No, I don't need to know how to switch allies. Alright, let's, let's see if Bowser's any good in this game. Um, He's level 14. He doesn't come equipped with anything. I can give him the Antiform pin for now. I can give him the four. I can just give him all the gear that Geno has. Yeah. And we get one of the best songs in the game. And it carries over into the battles, even better. Oh my god, the Sniffets are weak to ice. Oh yeah, that's gonna hurt. Bowser's really weak to magic. Oh, uh, isn't this guy weak to jump? No, he's not? Um, Peekaboo. That's a good name, that's a good name, actually. <laughs> Ooh. Hey, there we go. I did damage to him. Missed opportunity to restore the, um, the offensive Bowser. <laughs> From the Japanese version. Oh, god damn it. All the enemies in here resist ice. Why are you using restore? I didn't even damage you, bro. Oh, that does damage. Alright, what- are you weak to jump? Mm, not really. <laughs> Somnus Waltz. Oh fuck, I hate that move. Um, oh, Peekaboo costs a lot, actually. Mm -mm -mm. 
There's not really any easy way to kill the orb user. You just have to hope you get a good hit on him. Yeah, that was the only move I could actually use. <laughs> it was the peekaboo. Because jump doesn't do anything to him either. Just one damage. Hmm. Why did I have Wait, when did I get Galaxy Blast? Wait, what? I I have this now. Uh, okay. <laughs> I got a Sun Rhapsody. Wait a minute. Hang on a second. Did he forget to change the? Did he forget to actually change the Galaxy Blast into a Star Caracola? I think he did. So it gave me a Galaxy Blast for free. That is a really bad idea, because now I'm a little too overpowered. And I need to go to them in again, because I ran out of FP. So, uh, ga game kind of broke now. <laughs> I found a bug. Dev, Dev, you need to fix your game. <laughs> Yeah, that, it's like, it even said, like, oh, it gave you a Star Caracola, but it actually gave you Galaxy Blast, which is not what I'm supposed to get. And, well, since it's reusable, um, yeah, rip the game's challenge. <laughs> oh, now, if I remember correctly, the Sniffets are weak to ice. I wonder if they, are they still weak to ice? Let's find out. Yes, they are. Oh no, the game's challenge is gone. <laughs> I got a lot of money for that, though, at least. Get that free frog coin. And we get the funny man himself. I mean, this guy is basically just that Viking Wario. <laughs> I'm just gonna... Just gonna do that real quick. Also, can we talk about how hard they made that song in the remake? <laughs> that song goes so hard, it's gonna make you hard. <laughs> Like, the sax just goes crazy in the remake. Get a free flower tab. So far, I haven't been needing them, though, that much, because I haven't been running out of FP as much. Oh, oh boy. Um... Alright, you, you guys can explode. Five experience. I mean, it depends on how much experience we need for the next level. Gino needs one. Well, if he learns Gino boost, that's gonna be pretty great. I love how the bombs stop. Like, that's how you know they're dead. The perfect timing on this. Fairly generous, honestly. Alright, does he actually get Gino boost? Wait, no. Wait, he do He didn't. Huh? I thought he- wait, he learns that at level 15, never mind. When does Bowser learn his next spell? 25! <laughs> yeah, we don't get another cell for a long-ass time. Hmm... I don't really mind what I use, honestly. Oh yeah, let's go get the masher real quick. Every, every like, 10 or so times I do this, I end up missing it and have to go back up. I'm just glad this isn't one of those times. <laughs> so let's see, did they buff the masher? Let's find out. Yep, 
they they buffed it. Fear effect too. It doesn't increase my speed by two, but that's okay. So we got 25, 33, 15. <laughs> yeah, I like how Mallow is the fastest one of the group now. It's just there's something interesting about that. Well, chances are we're not gonna have to go ever go back and heal, because I have like how many flower tabs? Well, I have two, but still, that's quite a lot. And I also have 35 FP now, so that's quite a bit. At this funny room. The bombs respawned. Booster pass. Do the funny Easter egg. Funny thing is, you never hear the fast version of the music ever play out. Well, why use Ice Blast when you can use Galaxy Blast and just kill everything? <laughs> Rip the challenge. The challenge is gone. I killed it. By getting Galaxy Blast too early. <laughs> nice weather we're having. <laughs> I love that. I love that little Easter egg. That's a weird attack. Why did he do that? You know, to be honest, I'm wondering if it's worth fighting Booster or not. Because, I mean, the thing about Booster is he's, he's gonna... I'm gonna miss out on the amulet if I fight him. And I'd rather not miss out on that. Didn't they rename it something weird in the remake, like Booster's Charm or whatever? Yeah, Booster's Charm. I mean, the official artwork for the item is like one of those Japanese charms, so I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> I do find it super strange that they decided to keep this chomp the same with its normal design in the remake, but they decided to change all the other chain chomps to have the modern design. Yeah, you know, uh, that's another thing I noticed about the remake that's kind of off-putting, is some enemies got modern redesigns, but others didn't. Like, a good example is, like, the Dry Bones. The Dry Bones has the updated design, but for some reason the Goombas and Koopas don't. <laughs> and also we got a chain chomp, which... Gives him 20 attack. Speed 4 and fear effect. Holy shit, Bowser. Bowser's kicking ass now. I love that randomly you just get a you just sometimes get speed increases from like from like weapons. That's pretty fun. Oh, and like a free heal. So less reasons for you to use your flower tabs. I'll fight these guys. Yeah, we can see the uh, we can see the um, chain chomp in action too. Yuri jig, ooh, didn't do anything though. Eighty-two doesn't really feel like much, but I think this guy just naturally has a lot of defense. Yeah. Oh, more Sun Rhapsodies for free. Hmm. No, actually, it, no, so it actually turns out that this map... This map is actually, um, predetermined. There are actually very specific spots in the floor. Oh, the Bunny Hood? <laughs> That's the Zelda reference. What is that doing in this game? Defense 3, ma the Magic Defense 3, and Speed 30! Holy shit! Hmm. I'm gonna put that on Mallow, honestly. Yeah. You just make Mallow absolutely fast as fuck. 63 speed. 
Yeah, I mean, honestly, Mallow is my goat in this game. Oh, yeah, there's a, um, another weird graphical glitch in this room. Again, not, not big deal, but it's just something that's there. Alright. Are any of the chain chomps immune to ice? No, they're not. Carney kiss. Oh yeah, one of the worst fucking moves in this game, by the way. This Carney kiss just does a lot of damage for no reason. Because it's unblockable and it does like t two times damage. I think they made it blockable in the remake, though, so it's not as bad. It's very strange. I mean, I, I like that, though, that you can block more attacks in the remake. Like, mostly a lot of the physical attacks that weren't blockable in the remake, or in the original. Like, the bombs that Croco throws, for example. Spritz bomb is blockable, I think. Just stuff like that. What the hell is that Sniffit doing there? Hello? W what are you doing here? I got items? Wait, they added a shop here? <laughs> why is there a shop here now? More importantly, why is there a Sniffit? Why does the Sniffit want to sell me stuff? Honestly, I can sell a free- I can sell one of my flower tabs. <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? I, mean, I could buy a lime shroom, I guess. I mean, thanks for letting me sell my stuff, Sniff It. I'm gonna keep the spore ring just in case. Oh, really nice of him to add a frickin' shop up here, huh? Oh, yeah, and also the goodie bag is right here. So that's just a free 555 coins I can get. 999? Wow. Okay, so another thousand coins, now I'm rich. As if I needed more money, the game just hands out a thousand for free. Alright. Oh, there's another here's another graphical glitch in this room. I have no idea why that happens. It's just a, kind of a thing that happens with ROM hacks sometimes. I don't mind. I mean, it's not, like, game-breaking. It doesn't affect anything. He did say that on the page, that, like, hey, there's some graphical glitches. Watch out. That is a good question. Why is the peach doll... Why is the peach doll red and blue? You can still see the peach doll under Mario. Hey guys, it's right here, I found it. Wait, you need the Mario doll, right? I found it, guys. Guys, I found the peach doll. <laughs> Now for the Funi Curtain minigame that everybody loves. And if you don't love it, then you're weird. Because I can play this like 300 times and never get sick of it. And plus this music's Funi. Nope, it isn't here. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I believe you can do this entire mini game without running. It is possible. You just have to be like more prepared for it. Imagine if someone made a hack that changes the current mini game to be more of a troll. 
No, that would be funny. See, that's the thing, is nobody changes, like, the actual minigames or anything in this game. They always change the battles, which is more fun anyways, but still. D Got an amulet. I mean, I don't know, I, I, I you know, Moonis. In some cases, I prefer the, um, the name Amulet over Booster's Charm. But I don't know. Alright, so we have the Amulet. Does it do... All stats up 7. Does it also give, um... Does it also give, um... Does it also have elemental damage like it does in the original? I guess we'll find out. Um, it doesn't also- I don't think it lowers my stat- or my speed. Let me- let me double check. No, it actually ups my speed by 7 instead of lowering it. Yo, that's sick. Nice improvement, I- I- I like that. Because that's the- one of the only downsides with the amulet is that it lowers your speed in the original. But that's far from, like, a bad thing. Here's the Funi Clown Brothers. Alright, let's use, um... You know, we can use a Fright Bomb. That didn't fear him, unfortunately. Alright, go Galaxy Blast. Love that it does 255. Slicer! And you missed. Great job. Yeah, I could try and fear him again. Ooh. Maybe I fear a knife guy? Nope, they are immune to fear. Good to know. Also, out of curiosity, how much health does, da uh, does great guy have? 1,500. And he still has the incorrect tattle. <laughs> Peace is just a dream. Oh, I do a 382. Wait, he did get feared. Oh, wow. That hurts. Hey, I got a... Um, I got a Lime Shroom. I can use it. Actually, nah. I'd probably be better if I save it. Wait for Mallow's turn, and then heal. Heals like a hundred or something. Yeah, it's pretty good. Alright, now we can use a Galaxy Blast. I mean, I could use Ice Blast to see if they have elemental weaknesses. Oh. But if I had to take a wild guess, Great Guy is immune to ice, and Knife Guy is probably just, you know, neutral to it. But I guess we'll never know if we find unless we find out. Oh, he's weak to ice. <laughs> okay. He took 500 from that. 22, yeah, that's like nothing. Missed. Alright, I'm gonna jump on him. See how much this does. 96. The monster's getting furious. Oh, he, he's got Valor Boost. Oh, he actually retaliates once he kills his brother. That's, that's a good change. So it's gonna do like what 127? Oh nope, it still goes through his defense. I, think he, I don't know. Does he just do more damage or something? Possibly. Oh no, Bowser is muted, whatever will I do? <laughs> B 
bye 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 challenge. <laughs> I mean, if I can't cheese a game, if 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 I'm allowed to cheese a game, I will. <laughs> like <laughs> the whole point for a challenge hack is to just see how far you can like beat that challenge. You know, does that make sense? I got another flower tab. As if I needed any more flowers. So, I mean, if this is unchanged, this means I'm gonna get, like, anywhere from, like, 5 to 10 flowers, which is pretty damn good. <laughs> Mario, I may have become friends with you, but you can't come to my wedding. Fuck you, I still hate you for some reason. Uh, nope. No. Nope, I'm cocking up. Can we sniff it? Eh, messed up. Come here. Oh, man, I messed up big time. Going too good. Bro, I, I hate the hitboxes on the snippet sometimes. They don't work half the time. I, I can usually have way better luck with this. Well, let's see how badly I did. Mm, six is, I guess, is okay. Could have had way more, though. Brings you up to 41 flowers. Oh. Let's get that frog coin real quick. I'd like to buy some things. So we got the handgun for Gino. I, mean, I could just, I'll just buy everybody's weapons. The womp, womp glove. Chomp shell, which is actually worse. The slap glove for Peach, you could buy that early for some reason. So there's no weapon for Mario, obviously, because you're supposed to get the masher. Tuxedo shirt, tuxedo pants. Formal cloak. Broom shell. Pink dress, diamond ring. All stats five prevents effects, prevents element damage. So that's basically the lazy shell. A slightly less good lazy shell. Actually, it's like the safety ring. <laughs> it's like the safety ring as a piece of gear. Well, that might be worth saving up for, honestly. Okay, well, here's the funny thing, right? The forest cloak is still better than whatever Bowser's equipment is. Mmm. Honestly, I'm gonna just stick with the frickin' forest cloaks. If it protects against statuses, it's just all, all around really good. Like, they gave this to me early on, I don't feel the need to upgrade my, my gear, because it doesn't really increase it by that much defense. Yeah, I might save up for that diamond ring, honestly. Mmm. Honestly, I'm gonna sell these Yoshi candies. I don't need them. They're gonna clog up my inventory. <laughs> the Awakening. All 
All right, so put the handgun on Gino. In case we decide to use him again. And is the Womp Glove better? The Womp Glove is actually worse, still. It's still worse, because this gives me magic attack. And it only increases my physical by once. The Womp Glove sucks. Wow. Why does- why does Mallow's weapon suck? <laughs> Alright, um... Here, I'll keep the spore ring still. Mallow's weapons just suck, like, the- the Fuchsia staff is still good. Because that magic attack increase is really good. Since Mallow's just a magic user anyways. I think the cool thing is you can talk to, like, any NPC there. We have his, his funny expression there. <laughs> guess we're gonna go fight the cake today. I guess, was, honestly, the cake might be a decent difficulty spike, which is good. Oh, too early again. Too early again. Too early. There we go. I should probably save, just to be safe. You can never save too often. Anyways, I'm getting a lot closer to finishing my Toho highlights. And I've also been working on uh, Paper Mario packs. Well, Paper Mario- well, yeah, I have been, because I've been working on Down Bad Edition. Been slowly working on that. And, uh... I, I, I mean, I do feel a little bad copying some of the source code from Master Quest over to my hack. But, I think that's kind of the point, because if you really think about it, Master Quest is just a modification of the source code of Pro Mode. And Dark Star Edition is just a modification of the source code for um, Master Quest. So I don't feel too bad about it, and I think, you know, the creators don't mind too much as long as you credit them. It's not like you can get in, like, legal trouble, you know? <laughs> like, it's not like you're profiting off of it. So I copied a little bit of the source code because I wanted to make it so that Merlo's shop could carry more badges. I, I wanted to make it so that his shop could carry the Speedy Spin badge so he can get it early. Because that's one thing that I love that every, um, like, every hack does, is they let you get speedy spin early. And I decided to give, I decided to put speedy spin in Merlo's shop, so you can get it nice and early. So, and I, I decided to make it one star piece. I, I tried to make it zero, but there's kind of a problem with that. Because you can't technically make a badge zero. Otherwise, um, if you buy everything except for Speedy Spin, Merlo gets confused and he won't let you buy Speedy Spin. So I decided to make it worth one, one star piece. Because you're guaranteed to have at least one star piece by the time you get to Shitting Star Summit anyways. <laughs> Yo, I got a kiss from Bowser, let's go. <laughs> Hell yeah, the best ending. That's a pretty rare scene, actually. Just getting Bowser to kiss you. Actually, I think bo just booster kissing you is even more rare, honestly. So yeah, now Merlo has 16 badges instead of 15, which is a slight improvement. And you get it around the same time you get it in Dark Star Edition. I think it's Dark Star. Is either that Dark Star or Master Quest? I'm not sure. So, Alright, how much damage do these guys do? And also, let's see how much health the cake has. 450? 4,500? Holy crap. The great thing is the cake is still weak to jump. Alright, um, let's just get this straight. Is it immune to ice? 
Yes, it is. All right, no ice blast. Stop it. Is it immune to thunder? It's probably immune to all elements. Yep. All right, now, if I'm not mistaken, I believe super jump will be, like, the best option here. I'm still bad at the super jump timing, by the way. Alright, see the Sun Rhapsody. Alright, and... I mean, I guess, I guess we could just spam, uh, Stargust. Wait, no, that's not what we'll do. Actually, yeah, let's use Stargust. We can buy more of those, and plus it increase our attack. Another magic attack, though, sadly. Yeah. <laughs> Not very good at that. I never learned the timing. Like, I still haven't after all this time. I actually got decent at it in the remake because they give you more frames to work with. Like, it's uh, like a four-frame window, I think? I could be wrong. Um, do I still have that Fright Bomb? No, but let's try Peekaboo anyway. Ooh. It is, a, it is weak to fear. Alright, nice. You can do the multi-strike. That's kind of funny that they do that. Alright, so let's see how much, um, Galaxy Blast does, then. 255. So it caps out at 255. Alright. My timing is so wrong. <laughs> oh, I don't remember what the timing was. I know Pidge made a video on it, or like a website or something. And I remember she said like, it, it's, it's something weird, like, when Mario's like foot lines up with the enemy or something like that. I don't remember exactly. So do we still have to blow out the candles? out of FP again. Alright, I think we'll use a, our first Moon Serenade. Oh boy. That's not good. The monster is mute. Wait, I muted him? How? How did I mute him? <laughs> Eight damage. The monsters. I muted. I muted the the cake. What the hell? All right, I kind of need to heal. I think we'll use. I think we'll use the star gust again. Honestly, just to be safe. doing a lot of damage to the monsters. I, I muted him somehow. I don't know how I did. But I won't complain. Yeah, we're doing, like, no damage to him. Alright, bye, cake. Sheesh. That, that damage is very uncool. Let's just try a normal jump. Well, it still does a decent amount. Ionizer? <laughs> the fuck does ionizer mean? Oh, bye Bowser. <laughs> Wait, now I need to look up what that is. Hold up, give me a sec. Ionizer? <laughs> 
What does that mean? A device that ionizes. Wow, thanks. Thanks, Brave. Fuck you. In physical chemistry, to separate into ion to ions? <laughs> so it basically, like, destroys you into ions. Great, that's, that's very nice. Very nice to think about. Yummy cake. This cake's gonna take a while to kill. Is exactly why we're gonna keep Sim Galaxy Blast. <laughs> because otherwise, these bosses are never gonna die. Yeah, see, it does do 127 when you're feared. I had a feeling that was the case. Oh boy. Yeah, I might need to heal again after that. Did like half my health. Jump. 210. That's not bad, honestly. Oh, and the boss is over. <laughs> I should not have Galaxy Blast this early. And the fact you can get multiple of them is also kind of wild. This thing's a cake? What's a cake? Yo, Stumble Guys is on Switch now? What the fuck? I like how that's... That's what the one thing I got a notification on. Sir, some guy wanted me to play Stumble Guys. I don't remember. Uh, I don't remember what that was all about. But I don't know. The the Fall Guys craze kind of over. <laughs> it was cool for like a few weeks, and then it's just like whatever. Like, who gives a shit? I got- I got something up. I don't know what that was. What it was that? I didn't really get the seat. Alright, um... Give Mar more magic. That's always nice. Uh, Bowser, you can be physical, though. You know, I wonder if I should do another Mar PG run where I only upgrade HP. Because <laughs> I did that. I did that once. And it was not cool. It was kind of lame, honestly. Like, I think th even if you upgrade your HP all the way, you can't reach the max of 255. Because the max amount of HP you can have is 255. And Bowser gets to, like, 240. He gets pretty close, but he can't reach more than that. But I think the HP cap is a lot higher in this game. Which is good. That's honestly the only thing holding a lot of Mario RPGs back is, like, the... What do you call it? The stat cap. <laughs> Being able to cap your stats. Oh, the hey, the regular music played here. The regular stats, um, being capped is, like, kind of a shame. Anything worth buying here? <laughs> I buy the ruby gem now, if I really want. Or should I try and save it for the diamond ring? I don't know, I'm just waiting for this game to challenge me again. The counselor, as as my girlfriend calls him, not the chancellor. The counselor. Honestly, though, I still think one of the biggest missed potentials in the remake is to give you a reward for finding all the surprise boxes. I don't know why they didn't do that. Because I remember I made a ROM hack 
I don't think I'd ever- I don't think it ever got put into the final version. But I remember I made a hack where I actually made it so that you get something for finding all the surprise boxes. And like, he's like, you found all of them, good job. And then he says like, here, take this. And he gives you a rare piece of equipment. And I think honestly, more hacks need to do that. Why, why can't we have more of that? Like, I think it'll be a fantastic reward for finding all of them, and it also locks it behind Endgame, because you can't get all the surprise boxes until you go to the factory. And because of that, I think it'd be great to lock something really good behind that. Like, I don't know, it could be anything. It could be, like, something that increases your attack by, like, 30 and makes you immune to elements. So, some shit like that. I don't know. I don't really care. It's just, just make it something good. You know? It's just, the thing is, is that you can't really make anything too great because, you know, most gear already does, like, what you're trying to accomplish. Like, you know, the safety ring, it makes you immune to everything, you know? You know, the Jinx belt gives you 27 with all your stats. Um, I think it also gives you, like, 17 speed or something. And then, like, the... What else is there? The... The, the Quartz Charm, you know? The Quartz Charm gives you, you know double stats at the start of a fight, and it makes you immune to death. <laughs> you know, it's just, everything like that is good. So, making a unique equipment that's, like, somehow on par with that is kind of difficult. And also the ghost metal is just kind of, it's kind of mid. I don't know. I think compared to the, like, I think compared to the ghost metal, the trooper pin is way better, because the trooper pin gives you, like, 10 speed, I think? It gives you it gives you double attack at the start of a fight. Oh, and also shoutouts to the funny Mario face. <laughs> oh, and also another thing, the um that Mario sprite I believe is only used like four times in the whole game. <laughs> It gets used twice in that cutscene. It gets used once in Nimbus Land, and then there's also the Easter egg of, like... Uh, what am I trying to say? There's a, there's a little-known Easter egg where if you save, if you go to the save block, like, ten times, and you don't actually save, Mario makes, like, a unique sprite. I kind of actually want to show that off, because I've never shown that off. And I think it's in the remake, too. I could be wrong. It's just one of those random things that I never knew about for years. Anyways, we have the best partner in the game now. And honestly, she might she might replace Bowser. Because, uh, yes, of course. Oh, you actually have to buy her a weapon. <laughs> That's weird. Okay, question though. Is the is the forest cloak better? Uh I mean, in some ways. I mean, honestly. Just give her the forest cloak anyway. And give her the, uh, antiform pen. Actually, just give her the spore ring, that's better. Spore ring, uh, makes her null the mushroom, and that's honestly the only status I really want her to be immune to. Actually, if anything, make her immune to, um... I would love to make her immune to fear. Well, no, this makes her immune to... No, this doesn't make her immune to mute, actually. This is only sleep, poison, and mushroom. It's still something, though. So I actually have to go to Marymore and buy Peach a weapon now. <laughs> and she doesn't learn a new spell until 30, 23. So we're gonna be stuck with therapy for a while. I mean, that's okay. I'm okay with that. Oh, hey, look, the tenor card has a little item now, or a little icon. Juice Bar Tier 3 card. It has a nice little description, too. Okay. Well, in that case, let's... Oh, yeah, let me show up the Easter egg. Nope, not that. So we're gonna... We're, we're gonna not save. You have to do this, like, ten times, I think. It's really weird. Is it five times? 
I swear this is a thing. I'm not making this up. Yeah, I might be more than like, might be more than this. It might be like 10 times. If this guy changed, I'm gonna be sad. <laughs> I could be misremembering, honestly. Maybe you have to, maybe you have to save a bunch of times. I don't know. It's, it's really weird. I'm gonna try this a few more times. Save and saved. Yeah, I don't remember what the, what the trigger is, but it, it's something like that. I know that. But whatever, I'm wasting time. Anyway, it's time for the most arbitrary part of the game. Having to talk to Frog Fuchsius to open up Star Hill. For no fucking reason. Ooh, boosts all stats. This might be better than the Star Gust. Yep, my pink dress. Um, I mean, I might keep those old accessories. So, is there anything worth buying with my 26 frog coins? Probably not. Like, I think I should just save up for the Heartstone. Wait, no, the Star Egg, I mean. 90 frog coins, though. Like, I'm gonna need to grind for that anyways, so... Maybe I should just get the power all. Get a couple of these. Oh, he, he actually had new dialogue. Monsters will be stronger. I'll be the judge of that. If the monsters are actually stronger, that, that'd be great. That'd be great, actually. In other words, maybe you could just buy diamond rings. <laughs> I definitely need to save up for that, though. Alright, Slap Glove for Peach gives her 7 attack and 3 speed. I mean, that's honestly a decent upgrade, all things is considered. I think maybe I should give the bunny hood to give the bunny bunny hood to Peach instead. Having her go first is actually really nice. I think by default she has like the most speed anyways. Oh no, she doesn't. But she has 53 now, so she's gonna move first. Yep. Looks good to me. Oh, I think Gino's finally gonna learn Gino boost. Oh god, I forgot how dark this place is, jeez. It looks so nice in the remake. Oh yeah, I want to show off the funny Gino Easter egg. Oh, great! Soul? Alright, let's do, um, Ice Blast. Let's see how much this does. Ooh. Yeah, that did, uh, that did- I still didn't kill and did a lot of damage. 
Well, maybe the challenge will be just right then. And they all outspeed us too. Is this the same blue Amanita from earlier in the game? I think it is. <laughs> Oh my god, they actually have a lot of health, what the fuck? Is this a, like a stronger blue Amanita or something? Wow, okay, yeah, the enemies are way tougher. That's good. Wow, the Mukumukus are hella tanky. <laughs> they really expect you to grind? Oh, by Mallow. <laughs> Yeah, who, who needs to grind? Am I right? Although they don't really give much more experience than usual. I mean, like, the experience growth is okay, I guess. Oh yeah, is therapy... Therapy's still 3 FP, so... It's arguably better to use. Yeah, the enemies are definitely a lot harder here. Oh god, no, the graphics! What have you done? You can't have two massive dooms on screen. Wait, what? Is there another? There's another enemy here? I don't think this loadout was properly tested. <laughs> Wait, does Galaxy- Oh, Galaxy Blast! Uh Causes a, a bunch of effects. So it's even better than I thought. Oh, it causes fear. Oh, shit. Die, Blue Amanita. Need to get out of here. Okay, definitely don't do that loadout too often. I mean, it doesn't affect the game. It just, just it looks glitchy. Star boost. Okay. Eh, we'll go magic. I don't know. It doesn't really matter too much. Get back here, Sackett. Fuck, I missed him. I was gonna ask if he was worth fighting or not. There he is. No, come back! Fuck. Alright, we have this slot out again. Well, just a galaxy blast in it. Puts the enemies out of commission. It just, it just freezes them. Puts them to sleep. Yeah, throw a coin at me, that'll do it. Wait. I thought he was I thought he was asleep. What the hell happened? Is he muted? Is he muted? Is that what happened? I think he got muted or something. <laughs> I mean, that's cool still. I kind of forgot that when enemies get muted in this game, they, like, just freeze for no reason. I'll worry about the sacket later. I mean, there's probably more sackets anyway, oh, like, right here. I mean, as long as they don't run away, it'll be fine. He can't use- yeah, he gets mute, he can't use, uh, spells. Man, those Mookamookas are really strong. They do, like, a fuck ton of damage. Oh, bye, Mallow. I forgot to heal- wait, Ma did I not heal Mallow? No, I did. It's just he- he- he dies too easily. Ooh, tanky. He has lottery. <laughs> Bye. 92 coins. Wow. Alright, let's heal up everybody. I think, this one's I think that's that move's actually better for healing in the overworld. Oh, I man, hey, the enemy's being stronger. I'm, I'm okay with that. 
because the game was getting too easy, and now the now the challenge is rightfully back up to where it was before. Even with Galaxy Blast, still decently challenging, which is good. Yeah, throw a music note at me. <laughs> no amount of uh, training could save me from the horrors of Star Hill. Oh, and you have migraine. Boom. I can't tell if I perfect blocked that or not. I did not perfect block that. Alright. I think, I think honestly now would be a fine time to use the flower tab. Again, I haven't been using my flower tabs much. Oops, I didn't mean to use that. Well, uh, rip. Rip my awakening. Damn, Mallow just can't catch a break. <laughs> He's trying to use Galaxy Blast, bro. I don't know why I didn't default to that like it's supposed to. <laughs> waste of waste of red essence. I mean, we're gonna find more red essences later anyways, so it's okay. I'm not too mad about that. Alright, bye Mallow. <laughs> He's dead again. <laughs> Mal dies way too fast now. Maybe I should have Bowser out instead or something. Yo, I got a gold bar. Let's go. How much do those sell for? Sells for 5,000 coins? Oh my god. Dude, I just got a rare drop. I have monies for, monies for days now. I can, buy, I can actually buy that diamond ring now. <laughs> uh, which one am I missing? This one? What What the fuck is that thing? A Prenta Koopa. What? There's a Magic Koopa here now? Random new enemy, apparently, on Star Hill. What is he- what is he gonna do? I'm kinda, I'm kinda curious, I wanna see it. What- what- what can he do? He- he can do that, that's a bit underwhelming. Do like some cool magic or something. Oh. I'm- I muted him, so I don't think we'll get to- I don't think we'll get to see him in action. Bro, I'm doing like no damage. He sure can attack, though. He can he can use his wand as an attack. Bro, I could not imagine playing this without the Galaxy Blast now. These battles would just go, go on forever. Peach can't do any damage. Mallow's elemental attacks will probably get nulled out. And yada yada yada. Where am I? What am I missing? I'm missing one up here, okay. Okay, I think this is the screen with the stars, the star piece. I kind of want to see the funny Easter egg. I don't know if it's not an e I don't know if it's an Easter egg, but it's a really funny, um, sprite of Gino getting pissed off for you trying to leave without the star piece. Yeah, let me try this. <laughs> Look at his angry ass face. That is a super rare sprite of Gino that you never see anywhere else in the game. It's really funny. The only other time you see that animation is when, um... The Geno, like, the Geno clone is attacking you. That's the only other time you see that. 
it's really funny. I don't know why they, like, limited that animation to just there, but... It's really cool. I never knew about that for years. I only found out that, like, maybe a few years ago. <laughs> Just Gino, like, getting pissed off. He's like, bro, there's a fucking star right there. Go get it. Don't leave. <laughs> Honestly, I think we might be able to finish the, um, the seaside arc today, if we're lucky. Just because this is going by so fast. Well, and plus seaside town's bound to have some good stuff as well. Actually, question, do the starter pieces, um, restore your health? No, no, they don't. Thanks, I'll sleep. No. I'm kind of scared to hit Alt-N, because I feel like that's going to mess up my game. You know, let's find out. No, but it didn't play out of the fucking headphones, it played out of the TV again. Every time, bro. Every time it plays out of the wrong place, it plays out of the TV and not the speaker, or... Well, those are the speakers. You know what I'm trying to say. Alright, it, it, what we got in the shop? Because this is like one of the best shops in the game, ironically. This shop has, um... Ivy Shrooms? Mm, this shop kind of sucks. They don't sell anything good in here, compared to the original. Well, we might as well come in here, because we gotta talk to the Elder. Alright, and here's one of the best shops in the game. This shop's gotta have some good stuff. See ya! One of my favorite items. Magic Mirror. <laughs> Coin Trick. All stats, three, doubles coins. Oh, it, it gives you stats, too, huh? All stats, three, doubles XP. Yeah, that's always good. Supply ring. All stats, five, prevents mute and has FP cost. Wait, they made the jump? They made the jump boots? Whatever it's called. A rare accessory? Become the element jump. Use jump on any foe. That is actually really good. I kind of want that. I mean, for Mario, that's pretty good. Hmm. I don't have enough, unfortunately. I, can't, I could buy the Sia. Although, honestly, I don't really need the Sia because I'm not playing the Rando. It's mostly useful in the Rando because, you know, you want to be fast and run away, guaranteed. So, uh, I know what we're saving up for. We're saving up for that jump ring, honestly. And also, um, we're gonna do some grinding in a bit here. Well, this guy sells... this guy sells stuff. He sells the super hammer. Is that better than the masher? Uh, but yeah, honestly, I'd say it's more... I mean, it's only plus five attack, and I don't get fear. The handgun still, the womp glove, pink dress, marine suit. The weak to thunder. Resist thunder? Ooh. Why would you ever get the marine suit, then? Null's ice damage. Oh. Shroom rain. Oh, they still have, um, they still have the, uh, what you call it? The able, what was it called? The, the group recovery or whatever? I forget. Revives downed allies. I guess I could buy one of these. Should I get the sapphire gem? Hmm. I mean, Resisting Thunder is pretty nice, too. I'd have to think about it. I might get one of them. Yeah, one one is fine. 
The ship sank. Yeah, yeah, we know, we know. We don't care. Alright, well, uh, don't mind me, guys. I'm gonna grind for a little bit, so uh, bear with me here. This is, like, the optimal grinding spot. Oh my god. <laughs> so many levels. We got levels for days, guys. Never give Peach anything but magic. Why, why is her magic attack so low? <laughs> That's weird. Alright, I mean, if these, thankfully these guys attacking first is really good. Oh, I need my juice. Why aren't you guys doing more damage to me? Bro, I don't need this shit right now. Yeah, there we go. Better. Do that. <laughs> the problem is, it's gonna take a while to die, because these guys don't even do that much damage, even when I have all my armor off. Why are these guys, like, piss easy now? Just keep doing that, please. <laughs> Viroplasm. To be fair, that is a very underutilized, um, attack in the original. Like, I think the only enemy that uses it is the Amoboid. Or Amoeboid? I think it's Amoeboid. It could be, a. Uh... I think I've been pronouncing it wrong this entire time. I don't know, Amboid sounds cool, though. Alright, can you attack me instead of fucking healing over and over? That's why these guys are really annoying to fight. Okay, there we go. Burp, burp, burp. Another, uh, get another set of level ups. Get Mario. Oh, but he got two level ups from that. I guess Mario was pretty close to level up before that. If this is how they want me to train, I'll do it. I'll do it this way. You think it'll be easier to die to the bloopers? Maybe? Yeah, this might be- this might be easier, honestly. Ink Blast. Okay, yes, much better. Much, much, much better. These guys are actually doing damage to me. <laughs> yes, very good. Alright, now I'm actually taking damage. Good. I think the Star Hill enemies were just really dangerous. Like, for no reason. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know how many- I don't know how many times I should do this. But, I'm not gonna keep doing it for a little bit. Even if it is kind of boring. But, I mean, this is how you grind in this game if you need levels. You just kill these stars over and over again. I just barely got that last one. Oh, 18. 
Yeah, ma magic level ups are just the way to go in this game. Except for Bowser, his magic sucks. So when do we get another spell? 23? 20? Yeah, we're gonna need a lot of leveling up before we even get any of those cool, cool spells. I mean, he did say to train up, so I'll do just that. Oh wow, five bloopers. That'll be pretty useful for um, dying quickly. Is there? A, did, did I map the speed up key to anything? That's a frame by frame. Oh fuck! How do I disable that? There we go. I don't know what the speed up key is. Hold on. Let me figure out what that is. It's my hot keys. Um, fast forward is mapped to something. I don't know what it's mapped to though. I think it's one of the. Uh... I don't know. It's it's not. It's not even mapped to anything. Uh, I'll map it to, um, yeah, that. Map it to, uh, map, map it to L3. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> wow, that fast forward looks hella choppy, what the fuck? Look at all these levels. Woo! <laughs> nice. Level 19! Pretty much everybody got a level up again. I mean, her magic defense is pretty damn good, at least. Well, Bowser got two level ups, even better. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this for, like, a little while, because I have no time to do it. <laughs> yeah. Just, uh, just keep attacking me. Wait, wait, the blooper has lightning orb? That's kind of funny. Underrated move, by the way. I'll do this like two more times. You pretty much get like a full level up for everybody every time you do this. Mario leveled up. Mal learns smite. <laughs> He's gonna smite you, bro. When does Mario learn his next spell? He learns at 23. What is Smite? Smite the enemy with thunder. Okay, so it's just Shocker. It's a different name. It's 10 FP. Uh, I kind of want to level up Peach level 23 and get Group Hug. New run, yeah. <laughs> Alright, just gonna, just gonna die again. And thankfully, there's a lot of bloopers attacking, so it'll make this really quick. Alright. I do really want to get Peach's new skill. I think, I'm, I'm assuming it's Group Hug. She doesn't learn Group Hug normally. That's a lot of level ups, bro. Holy shit. Mario's level 21 now! I mean, yeah, these stat ups are kind of meh. Yeah, one more level up for Peach, and then I'll stop. Just so we can get her a group hug. Although probably it probably is not called group hug. It's probably called something weird like friend friend uh, heal or something. <laughs> Wouldn't put it past this game. Blooper. Alright, anytime now. 
Thing is, it's, it's gonna get harder to die because I'm getting more, um, more level ups and stuff. Okay, I think now, now we can probably, uh, we're probably fine to stop grinding. Two level ups. Three, four, five. Yeah, five level ups. Actually, that guess the question is, when does everybody lose lo 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 spells? Uh, it's still a cold group hug, okay. Alright. Doesn't Mario learn a new spell at level 23? Yeah, 23. 30. Okay. It's 7 FP. Therapy for everyone. I mean, yeah, 7 FP. Honestly, understandable. I need to know, how much does Geno Boost cost? 9? Yeah, that sounds about right. I was, I was expecting 10. Didn't Bowser learn something new as well? No, he learns it at 25. Bowser's spells kind of suck anyway. Put Geno on then instead. Actually, no, because that means I have to change out the equipment. You know what? Let's put on the, uh... Let's give him the rubber suit, honestly. Resist Thunder. Or should we give that to Peach? Maybe Peach can have that instead. Give Mario the amulet, and... Mallow can have, um... The Antiform pin. Yeah, there you go. That looks good. Alright, now we can see what's in these chests. Full heal, flower, and a frog coin. Okay. Alright, so I went from level 14 to level 22 from that. Yeah. That's, that's a good enough. That's some good enough grinding, I think. We're gonna do some more grinding when we get to Land's End anyway, so... If we need levels, that's where we're gonna do them. It's even better in Land's End because, you know, you get, like, two stars to mess around with. We got a gold shroom. Well, it is actually a gold shroom. Oh yeah, that's right, I was gonna sell that gold bar. Let's fight these enemies properly this time. And by proper, I mean spamming Galaxy Blast. The monster is mute. Yeah, damn right, you're mute. You like you should be. Star friend. Is Ice Blast good against these guys? Yeah, that's pretty good. Actually, I think that was after. I think that was the damage I did after I feared them, though. Alright, hey buddy, I have a gold bar to sell. <laughs> yeah. Alright, now we're gonna leave the dungeon, we're gonna go back to Mary Moore, and we're gonna buy that diamond ring. That's not Nary Moore, that's Seaside Town, bro. What are you doing? Of course, it's 7,000 coins, so it takes a while to grind up for it, but... Trust me, this will be worth it. And we are gonna put that on... Hmm? Honestly, yeah, we'll give it to Peach. I, actually, no. Give it to Mallow. <laughs> there we go. And give give uh, Peach the bunny hood. There we go. Unfortunately, that means he won't resist statuses, though, which kind of sucks. Swap these around, then. Because this is immune to everything, so it doesn't matter. Well, I mean, if it doesn't matter, then yeah. Give Mario the rubber suit, then. <laughs> Perfect. Because we don't want Mario resisting thunder could be good, since a lot of enemies in that dungeon use thunder. All right, I think we're gonna take a little break 
to um, use the bathroom, so I'll be back, guys. So we're gonna go back to the sea. Uh, I need Marissa over here. And uh, yeah, I'm kind of I'm kind, of, kind of OP now because now I have a diamond ring, so I'm just immune to all statuses and elements. It's basically like getting the safety ring slightly earlier in the game. <laughs> like, you normally get it in the sunken ship, and then the challenge kind of falls apart. Here's the difference, though. You can buy multiple diamond rings, so you basically just get three safety rings. Wait, no, it's the safety badge, not the safety ring. The safety ring is the slightly less good one. Oh, and the enemies are just gone, by the way. I don't think these guys ever respawn. They're just permanently gone. Ten damage. <laughs> Two. <laughs> yeah, I think all that grinding really made a difference. Galaxy Blast. The blooper lived! By the way, I was thinking about something while I was gone. And honestly, I was kind of wondering, like... Should I, um... Should I do, like, a skill swap in this game? Now, the thing is, is, um, skill swap... If anybody doesn't know what skill swapping is, I'll explain it. But skill swapping is basically when it's, like, a couple frames... Ooh, wow, look at this place. For a couple frames after grabbing the star, you're able to um, swap your party members around and open the menu. And in doing so, if there's a partner that's about to learn a spell, like for example, Mario's uh, Super Fire Ball, Super Flame, you could swap. Actually, no, you can't do it with Mario. Mario's an exception. But any character, any of the main four characters, besides Mara, you can swap around. You can actually give them different moves when they're supposed to learn them. Um, so obvious, obviously, um, like, none of my characters are gonna learn spells for a while, but I have the idea, like, what if I gave Peach... Because Peach has the best magic attack in the game. So what if I gave Peach, like, some of Geno or Bowser's moves? <laughs> Just give her extra moves to mess around with. And I thought that'd be kind of funny. Nice background, though. What the hell? The, the pirate guys are here. Bandana blue and bandana red. That's interesting. They show up a lot earlier than expected. Too bad they're not gonna do all that much because I'm gonna cheese the shit out of them. Oh, they're also weak to ice. Also, why do they have so much health, bro? Like, why do they have more than 500? <laughs> like, these guys have, like, hundreds of health. These guys have more than, like, 700, bro. Also, Scythe. Thankfully, it doesn't insta-kill anymore. Are these guys... Are these the kind of guys that you have to kill with thunder? Are they like- are they like dry bones where you have to kill them with magic? <laughs> if so, that's kind of interesting. So what the fuck is going on out there? Sorry if you guys hear that. This is why I'm glad I don't record with my shitty noise suppression anymore, because you guys would be able to hear that crap. Oh, okay, let's see. Um, do Ice Blast. Let me try Shock Storm. See if that kills the Greeper. No, it doesn't. How the fuck did I- Did he- Does he really just have that much health then? They really just have that much health. I really do think they're supposed to have, like, some Ice Blast or Fire Blast at this point. Icicle Saw. <laughs> I'm immune to that bitch. Ow. Gonna just heal that right back up. Yeah, get out of here. I'm gonna check how much health the Greeper has. 
Oh, is he immune to jump? Wait, he died from jump? <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Okay, this makes no sense. What the fuck? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Okay, ignore, ignore the bandana enemies. Wait, what? Wait, so you have to... So you have to get his HP to zero. And then you have to use a special attack to finish him off. That's fucking weird. Also, I want to see how much health... Just how much health these guys have. Two ninety six. Any reaping to be done? So I, I think they just have a certain amount of health, and you have to use a magic attack to finish them off eventually. That is very strange. Okay, well then let's use a thunder. Let's use shock storm and finish them off. So they actually don't have that much health, but they they work the same way as a dry bones. Also, why am I randomly just taking damage? I'm not taking damage from, like, anything. Yeah, here. A experience. No, that's nice to see. I'm gonna assume the dry bones work the same way, though. I mean, I guess we'll find out. Ooh, oh, that's kind of cool. They actually changed the enemies in here. So instead of alley rats, we have souls. That's a good change, honestly. Alright, so if I'm correct, this should still kill the dry bones. No, it doesn't. It doesn't actually kill them. Well, at least, uh, at least we're immune to thunder. Okay, I might need to use, um... Might need to use another ice blast, then. And then I need to, uh... Then I need to use it again. Oh, wow, these guys- these guys are way more annoying now, because now you have to use- You have to get their health to zero, and then you have to use a magic attack to actually kill them. That's cool, though. Bye. Thankfully, it doesn't really seem to be picking up any of the noise outside. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of picking up, but not really. That's why I'm glad I have this noise suppression. Also, I have, like, no room in my inventory left. Let's use some of these red shrooms. They're kind of useless now. Yeah. Need to free up some space. I mean, I have holy water now. Use on ghosts and undead. That's probably why they give those to you. Yeah, so the alley rights are fireballs now. They're lost souls from Doom. I mean, honestly, out of all the enemies in here, the rats seem like the weirdest choices anyway. So, I'd say that's a good change, honestly. Lightsaber. <laughs> it's the Japanese name, yay! <laughs> Miss. Miss! Yeah, because it's a fun fact that the Mega Drain move, it's called this Lightsaber in Japan, which is a really cool name. Alright, I feel like jump is kind of getting outclassed now. Like, it doesn't really do that much. But maybe it's because I'm spamming Ice Blast every battle now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I don't really feel the need to fight most of these enemies, honestly. Let me get this real quick. Get a full heal, because why not? Go in this room, get a free flower. There you 
go. Free flower, and I, the other rooms are kind of pointless, so we're gonna skip them. Well, I'm gonna go. I want to go in there. Oh wait, this is a different. This is a little bit slightly different. They replaced the go the reacher with a gorgon. Gorgon, gorgon. A lot, that's a lot of damage, bro. The monster's mute. <laughs> the monster's mute. Good. Alright, let's have... And then we'll have Malo finishing off with Shockstorm. Wow, so you need it. You need FP to kill these guys now. The only ones that die are the Gorgons and the Lost Souls. Hmm. I'm gonna skip out on some of the coins because I don't want that Dry Bones to respawn. So this is the same shot from earlier. I don't have that much money now compared to earlier. Holy Water sells for 45. It doesn't really sell for much anymore. Well, I got a defense up. I think that's the thing I got from the boss earlier. Yeah, honestly, I'm gonna sell the- I, I might keep the forest cloak, actually. Alright. Screw all this, I'm gonna go fight the boss. I think I'm pretty much ready for, um, King Calamari anyway. That barrel is really, like, it's really the wrong color now. Oh wait, I'm dumb, hold on. Yeah, come in here, bitch. I like how randomly they always just change up the sunken ship's palette. Like, it's always like a dark, gloomy color. Alright, well, let's see how this goes. This would be a nice battle to have, like, the fire... the fire attack on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do I really out- I really outspeed the tentacles. <laughs> Actually, I want to see how much Ice Blast does. It's probably not going to do more than 255. It did 277. This fight takes fucking forever, though. Well, normally, anyway. I like how the pipe is, like, kind of yellowy now. Okay, that actually did some damage. Bro actually did damage to Mallow. Well, as far as I know, King Calamari doesn't really do a lot of spells, so that's not going to be too much of my concern. Wait, did I poison the tentacles? Interesting. Alright, let's see how much fireball does to him. Because normally this does a lot of weakness damage to him. Yeah, that's pretty good actually. And you can block that, by the way. Get rid of the, uh, the status there. I think he's also weak to Shocker. So I might try that out if he doesn't die too quickly.
That was a good one. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> That went pretty well, honestly. Mario learned Super Flare. That's a bad name. And by bad, I mean badass. <laughs> Super Flare goes hard. I mean, that's not like Sephiroth's move in Smash, but whatever. The, 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 the souls are shooting the bullet bills now. That's funny. That's cool, though. I love that they replaced the rats with souls. Gives these enemies more of a purpose. Alright. More ice blast time. Alright. Take a big dumb. No, they're not really threatening, are they? They do like seven damage. 23. Okay, let me try Smite on the Creeper. Yep, he's dead. And then we can finish these guys off with Ice Blast. Lol. Oh yeah, we're about to fight Hydon in a second here. Ah, hold up. Hold up. Ah, hold up. Sarah Star Crow Cola. Uh, I'll go back here and get this free frog coin too, I guess. I wanna see if Shockstorm kills them. Kill the dry bones. Hmm. Let's do Ice Blast, I guess. The monster's mute. Ow. Just do it again. More holy water. I might sell those, honestly. Alright, let's fight hide on then. See how this fight goes. I mean this could be this could be a tough one, but we'll see. Um let's start out with a defense up. That's just for Peach though. I wanna see how much health he has. He has like 800 in the original. So, let's see. N wait, 1993? <laughs> Why 1993? Monsters are inside- No, not the blue Amanitas again! Nothing- <laughs> These guys fucking suck. Get these guys out of here. Oh no. <laughs> it's like the worst anime they could have had in there. My my fears all uh, in my in my like nightmares, I see a, just a shit ton of blue amanitas everywhere. Oh, and they can fear you too. They don't really do much damage thankfully, but still. Um I did buy a bunch of power rolls. Let's use them. One ninety. Yeah, that's like nothing. Oh, and I guess I can't mute him either. Yeah, I just keep spamming Galaxy Blast. All right, bye. Is there anything I can use against this guy besides, you know, the usual? Nah, just keep spamming Galaxy Blast.
That does some pretty good damage. Hammer time! Why does he have that? <laughs> I mean, I ain't complaining. It's kind of funny for him to have that. Okay, he's dead. There's a panda right. That guy was kind of piss easy. We got 335 coins from that. Wow. Got a magic badge. Ooh, what is that? Uh, let's see. Wait, hold up. Wait, Mario doesn't learn any new spells? 2730. So Mario doesn't really learn any new spells. Weird. Okay. He, he capped out all his spells. Alright, so we have magic badge. Magic attack and magic defense 7. Okay. Why? Does it do anything else? Just gives plus seven? Or do I have to look up what it does? Like in the uh, lazy shell editor. Hit piss water. Probably has some other effect that I don't know about, like nulling magic damage or something. I'll fight a Mr. Kipper, why not? Are you done taking your turn? See how much Ice Blast does. Oh, they're dead. Yeah, I probably don't need to fight any more enemies in here. I mean, I guess Gino gets a level soon. I just like having Malice so I can know how much health the enemies have. Alright, here's the, like, room where it's almost impossible. Six Mr. Kippers? Oh my god. Okay, this is gonna, this is gonna take a sec. <laughs> there we go. This is why you don't let the six Mr. Kippers attack first, because they're all gonna fucking gangbang you. That's gonna give me a lot of coins. 48 and shroom juice. Raijin World. Why, why, like, rename all the moves from Gino to something cooler? I mean, I could play. It's, it's interesting. Now I have Shroom Juice, which are, I, I would have been nicer earlier in the game, but now it's kind of, like, pointless because I have Therapy. Alright, I need to know what's in here. Got a Power Badge. Oh, is it the, is it the opposite of the uh, Magic Badge? These are kind of lame because I have the Amulet already. Uh, if it was like power plus like 15 or something, then I might go for it. You know, plus 15 would be a little better than whatever the amulet does. You know, if you just want to hone in on one stat in particular. And get that random frog coin and then we're done with this place, basically. Alright, we got the funny bandana red mini boss. These guys aren't really a surprise anymore, because we've fought them already. There's six of them, holy shit. Yeah, six of them's definitely... it's definitely a threat. They have more than 500 health? They do. The monster is mute. Why does some- why do I just randomly take damage? Miss, miss. Okay. Yeah, those guys take a while to take down. It's probably you can have six enemies per battle. Oh, I got another red shroom. Wee wee. 
all heal. <laughs> Was there gonna be like eight bandana reds now? Oh, they're blue now. Okay. Six blue guys. Alright. That's a fine natural evolution. Alright, you guys can all you guys can all take your turns. Doing two damage at a time. Actually, I think the reason why Mario doesn't taking that much is because uh he's got the amulet on. So that makes sense. And you guys are dead. Bye. Let you in the Johnny's place. Let's see how tough Johnny is, because he might actually wreck me, honestly. Um, you know, what? let me start off with a power power up. Where is my power all? There it is. Alright, I want to see something. How much health do the bandana blues have? Thousand, maybe? Seven hundred. Call me blue baits. Oh no, they actually did damage to Mario. How awful. <laughs> and I have a red shroom. So we do two galaxy blasts. Actually, let's not do two Galaxy Blasts, because that would kill all of them. Um, we just attack them. Well, a Shock Storm won't kill them, I know that. Yeah, just I think they just barely live. That's a fucking random 100 damage, bro. <laughs> That's so dumb. Okay, he's gone. Yep, he gone. Here's the thing, I actually can't cheese this fight because if because if I want to cheese this fight, I'd have to use galaxy blasts. But the problem is if I do that, Johnny 1v1's Mario. So I actually have to do this fight legitimately. So I mean, that's kind of cool, I guess. He has 1800. <laughs> what was that, Mario? It's all over. That's in, That's gotta be a new title. <laughs> Let's see how much Super Flare does. Four hundred forty! Holy shit! Now that's some damage. Um, there's not really any items I can use here. So Peach will be on healing duty. I'm out of FP. Fuck. All right, let's use some of our uh, Sun Rhapsodies that we have left over. We got plenty of those. I think they buff. I think they buff Super Flame. Super Flame, yeah. Because you cannot do like 400 with it normally. All right, let's see what Smite does as well. 367, man. I'm on a roll here with all this damage I'm doing. You know, I think it would be really funny. <laughs> there should be a there should be a hack 
where um, if there's only one bandana blue left, Johnny should take an extra turn to kill him and force Mario into the one-on-one. -on -one. Do you imagine how funny that would be? Get a freebie. I don't need freebies for Sun Rapsies, though. Pissy easy, bro. I love how he just vanishes. Double your coins, sure, why not? No, my coins! Whatever. So Mario doesn't learn anything else at this point. Yeah, I guess we'll fight Uranovich and then call it a day. We made some pretty damn good progress. And then I guess in the next episode, we'll do the whole, like, Nimbus Land stuff. And then... Finale? Like, I, I always forget how quickly the second half of this game goes by. Probably just because you get so, like, overpowered that, like, the rest of the game falls apart. <laughs> Although, I, I won't be surprised if Uradovich gives me a good fight. I'm kind of expecting him to. You guys say anything? <laughs> Did he say anything else? There's some interesting Easter eggs regarding, uh... It's mighty tasty stuff, mate. Alright, it's time for good old, uh, good old Uridovich. Oh. I mean, I wouldn't mind having some brownies. I do find it interesting that they changed that star in the remake to be pink instead of blue. But it makes sense, since there's already a blue star in the game, so having a pink one kind of balances things out, honestly. And usually you get healed after a boss. Yeah, I mean, honestly, this is probably going to be the way to go. Alright, time for Uridich. The Uridich fight could be a pain in the butt. We'll see, though. Alright, let's use, let's start off with a star wind then so we can raise all our stats. Alright, how much health does Yuridovich have? 6,000! That's four times as much as he has in the original. That did fuck all, actually. Yeah, nah, he's he's probably wait he's probably waiting to use like spear rain. That's when it's gonna all go south. Also, for some reason, Yuridovich is still red. He's not a different color. I kind of expected more, honestly. And usually he's weak to lightning, so let's see how much this does. Five hundred fifty. Yeah, there goes like half his health already. Well, not half, but you know what I mean. Honestly, Yurovich is kind of—he's kind of—he's kind of—I'm kind of making him my bitch right now. This might cost 10 FP. This is a pretty good, damn good move, though. Will-O-Wisp. That's, uh... 
It made me a scarecrow? Interesting. What does jump do? 251. It's not bad still. Interesting they made they decided to make Will O Wisp uh, move that turns you to a scarecrow. <laughs> I think that's just kind of a funny little side effect it does now. Three seventy five bolt. <laughs> No damage. Yeah, I'm just getting rid of all my Sun Rhapsies so I can eventually make room for Moon Serenades. He's actually doing damage now. Crazy. Pierce. The timing for Pierce has always been really weird, in my opinion. Because, like, you press it way after he actually hits you. <laughs> I don't know if they... Ch I forget if they changed that on the remake. It's kind of been a while. <laughs> Zero damage. Yeah, this fight's going pretty well, I'd say. He stays in Mirage form a lot longer. Which, you know what, I'd say that's a good thing. Keep smiting him. Oh, he's dead. Wow. Piss easy, bro. Yeah, I had a feeling the moment I got the Ice Blast, the challenge would just die. <laughs> Smithy is now in the race for the Star Pieces. Yeah, well, he's gonna have a hard time keeping up with me when I have freaking Galaxy Blast. One of the most broken pieces of, uh, like, one of the most broken items in the entire game. Having a reusable rock candy? Like, good lord. Aw, oh, Mario. You got a flower box. That is unchanged. Okay. I will probably save that for later, then. That's the first flower box I've got in all the game, actually, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, you have, um, good weapons. Troopa shell, that's- the that, I think, is worth upgrading, too. Sticky glove for Mallow, probably still not as good as the Fuchsia staff, honestly. That's all- that's all around a good upgrade, though. That's well extra attack. No Lucky Hammer, Aerosol. Does jump damage. Wait, really? That's kind of cool, actually. Alright, well, let's get everybody equipped then. Really? <laughs> wait, wait, seriously? Only two extra attack? That's kind of cool, though. This jump damage. These sell for a lot, though. I might sell these, honestly. Like, unless they have a... Is it possible for me to open this game up in Lazy Shell? I kind of want to do this real quick. Um... Mario hacks Lazy Shell. I'm gonna open... I'm gonna open this game up and see if I can do anything with that.
I'm gonna load, uh, I'm gonna load the ROM, if it, if it lets me, because we'll see. Alright, Mario RPG Masters. I'm gonna look at the items. Um, what's it called? The Magic Badge? The Magic Badge. Yeah, it does not give anything besides magic attacks. That's all it gives. It's just plus seven magic and plus seven magic defense. That's terrible then. It doesn't give anything. I'm looking at the... Actually, I can probably show you guys if I use a display capture. Hopefully this doesn't break my stream. Okay, hold on. Have a look, guys. So I'm op I opened the game. I opened up in Lazy Shell. Look, that's this is all it does. It just gives plus magic. That's it. No we no weaknesses, no statuses, no nothing. It doesn't give anything else. That's it. So yeah. That's uh that's, that's pretty bad. So I might sell these honestly. Just because the amulet is way better and I kinda would prefer to have the money, honestly. Is there anything else I can sell in terms of items? Flower box sells for a lot. Hmm. Maybe I'll just sell the flower tabs. Now I just have 8,000 coins. And I believe this guy, he sells... Oh, wait, he sells new... He sells new gear. Toady Invest. Defense 11. Protects against mushroom. Weak to fire. So it's kind of similar to the um, the shroom vet, the, sh the spore ring. Hmm. I say better than the. It's not better than the forest cloak though, if you ask me. Nah. Oh yeah, what does the accessory shop have? Kind of curious about that. You can buy the amulet? Holy shit. Oh yeah, you also, you also buy these different rings. Or gems. I could buy another di diamond ring. Metal Spirit. It gives you def extra defense. Null Thunder and Weak to Fire. <laughs> oh, or I could buy another amulet. Hmm. I mean, I could buy the diamond ring for Peach. You know what? Sure. Yep, there you go. <laughs> we are officially broken now. Alright, what do you have? Do you have anything good? I can buy holy water from you. I'm gonna buy some moon serenades. I'm gonna sell the holy water. Sell the red shroom, we don't need that crap. The old shroom sells for 125. Don't need the shroom juice. Star Caro Cola. Power All. Yeah, I think this is fine. Alright, bye. A mouse came by the other day. Well, we'll do Land's End next time. I think I'm, think I'm good on Mario RPG Masters for today. Mario RPG Masturbators. But, yeah, we, uh, we made some good progress. We gained, like, 12 levels in, the single, in a single episode. We kind of broke the game in half by having Galaxy Blast a little too early, because the dev... Forgot to replace the get the rock candy and booster pass. He forgot to change it into a Caro Caro Cola. So uh, the game kind of killed itself. But that's that's not my problem. I'm breaking the game because it's funny. But uh, either way, um, if you guys enjoyed this episode, make sure to like and subscribe on YouTube and Twitch. And um, I'm hoping I get to do a stream with Zach later today. 
If so, that'd be pretty cool. But anyways, uh, I'm gonna just rest for now, maybe do some hacking, maybe some video editing, the usual. And uh, I'll see you guys later today, potentially. So, see you then. Take care.